All right, so here we go. What I think you guys need to do is where this hallway is, end this wood floor from the rest of the unit right here at this uh, corner because that floor in front of this closet right here there's a dip. It's dipped down quite a bit. Pull this floor up and the flooring you put in the kitchen comes all the way through here. And will also go into the kitchen or into the bathroom I mean. Uh, if you're using the vinyl plank that's good because then this is all waterproof and extremely durable. The tenants can't damage it any. Next, the GFI is in the wrong place. I know you want a GFI over here. Uh, I guess right here on this wall, the vanity's there. Since you have this chase way right here, uh, you have the opportunity to run whatever you want from the floor up. So you can run your electricity right through the floor through here easy. Uh, I would run another circuit up here and into that cavity so you could put a fan right there. If you don't put a fan in there, lowering that ceiling down, this is going to be a steam box and you're going to have moisture problems. And uh, that's also sheetrock drywall on the ceiling versus hardy ba uh, dirt, hardy backer. Uh, and that's regular drywall. The mold resistant drywall is green. So if you don't put a fan in there, you're going to have issues. And it's real easy to do because you got that cavity. You can run power straight up through the basement into that cavity, put a fan here, and vent it. You could stand right on here and vent it through this wall. And uh, that way, you don't turn this into a steam room, this uh, bathroom. So a circuit here for the GFI, one up here for the fan. Uh, to fix this floor, one sheet of Luon, uh, half inch Luon will level this floor off. It'll be about a half inch higher than what's here. Uh, the only way to not do that would be to use a auto leveler, which is a concrete based product you'd pour on here and it would fill in and level this off nice and smooth. I just recommend you put a piece of Luon over top and it'll be a quarter inch. Quarter inch is nothing, it's small. This is the uh, biggest concern I have right here. So, one type of flooring, the vinyl plank through the kitchen into this hallway that gives you the opportunity to pull this floor up, fix what's right there, and into the bathroom. And it's all waterproof. That back wall uh, where the fridge was, this doesn't look like it's recent. This is very old damage. We, no one ever noticed it because the fridge was here uh, where the wall sweated. You had a little humidity and moisture in there. and It's not a big problem. That's an easy fix. And the bubbles, that's easy to fix too. Just scrape them and mud it. And then paint the whole thing. This baseboard here, when they did this, they did not match the existing baseboard. They just kind of, I don't know what they did here. And they just used an old piece to kind of patch them together. This is pretty bad. That's a uh, pretty, pretty shitty job. But the plaster on the outside looks good. They did a good job with this, other than a mess showing through. But they did a pretty good job with that. But that should be one piece to make it look nice. That's kind of kind of stands out right there. Alrighty, so that's my opinion, and uh, you guys have a great day.